Today we are with Soldier Kid and we're back with a late night studio sesh. Baby, big booty, Judy. This one route, this ain't no Susie. She take half, don't do it fully. Big old bag, I'm on my bully. Damn, I might be your biggest fan. Do that shit without no hand. Do that shit, say fuck your man, Judy. Judy, Judy. All right. So to start, where are you from? Gary. From Delray? Yeah. Were you born here? Uh, yeah. Yeah? And how did you come up with your name? Uh, I was a soldier since a kid. Were you like a fan of Soldier Boy or? Uh -uh. No? No, nah, I'm fucked up by Soldier Boy. Yeah, I used to like Soldier Boy. But nah, I just, but like, nah, my soldier don't got nothing to do with his soldier. You just feel like you're like a natural soldier. Yeah, yeah, for sure. Okay. Uh -huh. And what made you start making music? I just like music, I guess. You've always liked music? Did you make music as a kid or? Uh, yeah. I used to always like sing and shit like that. I was a jit. Yeah? Yeah. Did your parents make music or anything? Mm -mm. No? No. Nah. Did anyone inspire you to start making music? Anyone like kind of mm -hmm. say, hey, you should start making music or? Um, no. I just, I just always used to like making music like. Yeah. Even when I was a little kid, I used to listen to music and I used to like write down lyrics. Yeah. So then I just eventually started writing my own lyrics. So what inspired you to make your song Thug Paradise? Um, you know, everybody be going through things, you know what I'm saying? So I just wanted to um, touch base on a couple things and I just, I don't know, when I be writing music, I just be wanting people to feel me. Mm. I want them to feel like they can relate to what I'm saying and shit like that. Do you consider music your therapy? Like you write your feelings on the paper? Like, yeah. What is a lyric that is like really important to you? Maybe in that song or in other songs that you feel is really important to you? If you could think of any like specific lyric you wrote. It's an ocean in my heart, but baby girl, I can't swim. <laughs> what is it? It's an ocean in my heart? But baby girl, I can't swim. What is that about? Mm, that's a song I got called Suicide. Was there an experience that has changed your life for the better and maybe like made you write that song or like any experience? I don't know, I can't pinpoint no exact experience, but I guess just like experience in general, I guess. No, no like specific shit in one? General. I, yeah, I can't pinpoint that on the head, but just like, mm -hmm. just going through shit in general, you know what I'm saying? Do you think social media has changed the music industry? Like, now it's like, it's way easier for artists to get, like, seen and heard now, you know what I'm saying? And when did you realize this is going to be your full-time career? I guess since I started. Since you started, you were like, this is it? Yeah. Yeah? Since I started, I was like, bitch, I'm him. I was like, yeah. <laughs> I was like, damn, I'm slime. Like, wait. Like, did your friends tell you you were fire or you just, like, knew you were? Nah, I ain't need nobody to tell me I was fire. No? Nah. You ain't just... nobody to tell me. I just knew it, you know yeah. what I'm saying? You know no sir. Yeah. No sir. I, like, I know it. So like, mm. yeah. Did you ever have any like doubts or anything? Nah. No? no? I try not to doubt. Did you ever have any other jobs before? Um, no. No? Yeah. I ain't never had a job. Never had a job? <laughs> <laughs> you never had a job? No. Oh my gosh. Yeah. What does your creative process look like when you're like making a song? I don't know. We kind of looking at it, just vibing. You freestyle? Yeah. Or you write? I write. I freestyle sometimes too. But I like writing better. Yeah? yeah. So how long does it take you to write a song? Like, like twenty. Might take me fifteen. Depends on how I like the beat. Okay. Shit, it might take me two, three days. Mm hmm. It depends on the song. What is like your favorite studio snack? I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. We just always got Red Bull and Patron. In the Red studio. Bull. <laughs> <laughs> what does a realistic day in your life look like? Like a typical day? Wake up, shower, hit the studio all day. All day? All day. You be in the studio all day? Yeah. So how how many songs are you writing like a day? Sometimes I could do like ten songs a day. Sometimes I might do like five. Um, the other day I spent the whole day on one song you know what I'm saying yeah do you have any like cool experience you had on tour or, like funny experience I was in uh, Dallas we couldn't smoke in our hotel room so I went downstairs to go take a um, go smoke I was just vibing in some corner and a couple of jits had ran down on me 
with like pictures of me in their hand. Yeah. And they're like, can you sign this for me? I want to sign it for them, but I'm so shocked. I'm like, how y'all find me here? Like just posting <laughs> on chilling though, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. They're like, bro, it was on your manager page. Oh, they found you. And he took a little picture on, what he say? He took a little picture of the outside. We could just tell by the buildings where y'all was at. Mm. And I was like, but bro, even though like you knew the hotel, like I'm all the way over here though. Yeah. Like, nothing all. He say, bro, we was just waiting for your ass on okay? game. What? <laughs> I swear to God, I can't make this up. I swear to did, God. So you didn't, did you sign it? Yeah, I signed oh, it. Oh, you did? So was that like the craziest fan experience, encounter you had or do you have any other crazy ones? I got crazy ones, but that was like real crazy to me. Cause like, like I never, like I could, like that was crazy. <laughs> like they ran down on me. They, they yeah. stalked you. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> do you have any like weird, like groupie experiences? <laughs> <laughs> He's like, <laughs> are you spiritual? No. No? No. <laughs> no. <laughs> Every time I ask some, yeah. someone on these, they're like, no. But I'm like, hmm, okay. But and what's know. like a dream collab that you would want? Bro, it'd be raw if I could do some shit with like Billie Eilish. Billie Eilish? Yeah. Interesting. Okay. Yeah. That must be right there. Yeah. Hmm. And do you, how do you feel about like the new wave of artists? Do you like them? Everybody hard. Everybody hard? Yeah. Do you have any artists that you don't think are good? That are overhyped? No. Everybody's hard. Everybody's straight. <laughs> Everybody's <laughs> nice. Cool. Okay. Everybody do their little shit. What do you want your legacy to be as an artist? But. Oh. Even though everybody do their little shit, I don't think like harder than me. Oh, nobody's harder than you. Yeah. Confidence. Well, thanks so much for coming on. I appreciate you. Oh, wait. Also, before, is there any upcoming, um, anything that you have coming out that you want to promote? Yeah, I'm going to drop Strangers in Cali soon. I know my fans be wanting that. And I go get Diamond. I just dropped that on our platform. Okay. Yeah. Well, everybody, go check out Soldier Kid and his new music.